There is nothing more American than having a place to call home. It is what the American dream is all about. Hello, my name is Peter Rutsis Arroyo. Welcome to Casa San Juan Bosco, what many are calling the most beautiful farm worker housing facility in the entire country. The people who put the food on our tables deserve a decent lifestyle. Hello, I'm Sister Kathy Buster. This new quality housing development fosters independence and responsibility for the residents there. These are beautiful single family homes, three and four bedroom, two bath, beautiful kitchen with hardwood cabinets, everything you would have in your lovely home, they have in their lovely homes. And this is a first for them. Hi, my name is Andrea and welcome to my home. It's very nice and peaceful here. It's a really nice place to live. Hi, my name is Bettina Estrada and welcome to my neighborhood. My kids feel more comfortable. I feel more comfortable living here because they have their own rooms. Like they want to stay here forever. We have a wonderful management company available 24 hours, seven days a week. The families that are here are documented. They're hardworking farm worker families. My name is Mandy Hines. I'm the County Coordinator and Economic Development Director for DeSoto County. Here in DeSoto County, we depend on agriculture. Having affordable housing for our farm worker population is very important to our growers. Hi, my name is Justin Searles and welcome to my office. Working in an orange grove is hard work. Our business would not operate without adequate farm labor. They need good housing to be rested and ready to come to work. Many of our farm workers live in some of the most horrific conditions you'll ever find. I was working when I was 14. I used to live in camps where a lot of people live. Just one room for five, six persons. It was bad, it was bad before. I've never had a place of my own. My children still talk about where we lived before. They really love it here. It has more rooms, <laughs> more space to run. <laughs> this project is an incredible success. The community itself takes tremendous pride in the facility. It consists of 53 single family homes. All are energy efficient. All are built to withstand hurricane winds of over 200 miles per hour. And you've got to remember that is what put us in this predicament. Ten years ago, this region of the state, and particularly DeSoto County, was devastated by Hurricane Charlie. Affordable housing was devastated as well. The conditions were deplorable. They were living in broken down trailers with one or two other families. Out of this destruction was born Casa San Juan Bosco. Part of the vision is to help our families acculturate into life here in the United States. Education is the key to success. We provide after-school programming Monday through Friday for children and youth. Some of the children that are in the after-school program are now speaking English clearly, and they go home and teach their parents how to speak English. Projects such as Casa San Juan Bosco have a positive impact on the entire community. This development is attractive, it's well managed. This is a place to call home. Casa San Juan Bosco is 100% occupied. We have well over 100 families on a waiting list. I hope many years to come that we'll be here. They never want to move. They don't want to travel no more in the road. Our plans are to build phase two, which will be the additional 44 homes and a community center. In order to do that, we're going to need help. And then in the day, we take fruit for our kids so they can taste what we do in the field. Nice. It's just I'm really thankful for a place like this. Here is my home, our home. If you would like more information on how you can get involved, please visit our website.